starring Tommy Rettig as Jeff Miller. Jan Clayton as his mother, Ellen. George Cleveland as Gramps. And, of course, Lassie. Don't ever point a gun like that. Where'd you get it? On that high shelf in back of the hayloft. It was wrapped in a piece of canvas. It's your dad's. Put it away ten years ago. Clean forgot about it. It's mine now. I found it. No, 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 don't, don't grab, don't grab. Gotta be careful with guns, you know. Well, it's not loaded. Or let up, be just good as new. Let's go shoot it, Gramps. No, not so fast, not so fast. Ain't got nothing to shoot with. We ain't had no shells around here since, uh... Since when, Gramps? Well, never mind. That's all over with now. Can I have it? Maybe you're big enough for that. Gave it to your dad on his 12th birthday. Oh, gosh, I'm 11. That's almost 12. Yeah. Thanks, Gramps. We went camping up to Long Woods that year. And you know what? What? He hit the first thing he shot at. Timberwolf, it was. Gosh. I bet I could hit a timberwolf. Or a bear, even. Or a lion. Anything. Hi, <laughs> Mom. I'll take that. He uh, found it in the barn. It was my dad's. We're gonna shoot it. Gramps will show me how and I'll kill a terrible open. I never want to see that thing in your hands again. Do you understand me? Never. Put it back in the barn, Jeff. Masking you too. Put it back. Keep clear of the house for a while. I'll talk to you later. It's all my fault, Ellen. I got to thinking about the first camping trip I took with Johnny. And uh, one thing led to another. I know how you feel. But still, it's been a long time. What's time got to do with it? The gun killed his father. Yes, I know. He was my son. And yet you want to teach my son how to use a gun? Isn't there enough in this world we have to go through with being born, living, dying, without making it harder? Well, Ellen, the boy in the country gets to learn about guns uh, pretty early. Why? Why? Where is it written that anybody ever has to learn about guns? Well, it isn't exactly written, but... Uh... But what? Now, Ellen. You can't set the boy apart. A gun is the same as a knife, or an axe, or a piece of rock. Nothing bad about them till they get into the wrong hands. I suppose you're right. It all, it all seems so unnecessary. So is war, and drought, and pestilence. We got them with us. And the more we know about him, the better off we are. Where is he? Just came through the kitchen. You want to see him? Well, 
Come on in. No one's gonna bite you. I'm sorry I lost my temper, Jeff. It's all right, Mom. No, no, it isn't. At least you learned one thing, and that is that mothers aren't perfect. Now, about the gun. I was just making believe, Mom. I didn't mean to point it at I you. I know you didn't. That wasn't what startled me. I just don't like guns, but that's another story for another time. If Graham says it's all right, well, you can play with the gun. Just be sure it isn't loaded. Gee, thanks, Mom. <laughs> What's the idea of shooting my chickens? Oh, I wasn't really shooting them, Mr. King. I was just making believe. Look, the gun isn't even loaded. See, no clip. I sure wish I'd have had this about 15 minutes ago. I caught a fox digging under my hen house, and the firing pen in my 22 is bent. How'd you like to go hunting? Real hunting? It's real enough if we spot that fox. I'll get a cartridge clip, and you send Lassie home. Oh, why? Because guns and dogs don't mix unless they're trained for it. Besides, I got poison and traps out. Send her home. Go home, Lassie. Look, girl, me and Joe King are going hunting. And you haven't been trained for hunting. Now go on home. Go on. <laughs> You can carry it. Me? You know how to handle a gun, don't you? Well, sure. Sure I do. Well, come on. If you don't see a thing clear, you don't shoot at it. I didn't blow your head off. You got a lot to learn, boy. Don't you never get in front of a loaded gun. Never. Now go on home. Jeff said anything to you. About what? The gun. No. 
Now, don't fret about it so much, Ellen. The trouble with you is you, uh... He's coming. Uh, Mom? Mom, can Just I go you... out and look for Lassie? It's a little late, isn't it? I won't go far. When did you see her last? This afternoon. We... We were out walking, and I sent her home. Why? Why what? Why'd you send her home? Well, she didn't come home. I was working on the yard all afternoon. Come here, dear. Is anything wrong? No, Mom. You sure? Please, let me go out and look for her. She didn't have any supper. Neither did you. I wasn't hungry. Don't you feel well? I'm all right. Please, let me go look for her. Of course, dear. But put your jacket on. Thanks, Mom. Something's wrong. He's worried about the dog. No, it's it's more than that. She's been out a long time and time again. It's this gun business. I heard somebody popping away with a rifle up back to Joe King's this afternoon. He probably heard it too. I told you. What? He's heading for Joe King's Meadow. Well, I don't understand. It's just as plain as the nose in your face. All that talk about guns has got him worried. He heard those shots. Now he figures that Lassie got hit. Wait a minute. I'm going after him. Why? What happened? Tell you when to come back. Sorry? I don't know. I... Jeff, who gave you the shells? Nobody. Gun was fired, Jeff. Joe King loaded it. We were after a fox. He missed. Then he unloaded the gun and gave it back to me. Yes? I was coming through here. I was only making believe fire in the gun. I thought I saw a fox in there. Shell stuck in the breach. Uh, where, where'd you see the fox? Right there. Let's go take a look, huh? Right there. Ain't okay, nothing there. Gramps, you don't think it was Lassie? <laughs> Now, 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 now. Hold yourself together. Ain't no sign of anything there. But she could have been wounded and crawled away. Maybe she's dying someplace. Perhaps we gotta look. Well, we've got no place to look. And the chances are she's back in the kitchen wondering what happened to you. Come on now. Let's go see her. <laughs>
around here. George! Joe King. Tried to ring you, but your line was busy. She's on the seat. Lassie! Lassie! Almost ran over on the road, laying there half dead. Lassie! You mean a car hit her? I don't think so. You better hop in, George. You gotta get her down yes. to Doc Wilson. She's lost a lot of blood. No, 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 you can't go. But, Gramps! No, please do as I tell you, Jeff, will you? Ellen, take him in the house. Father, the dog is here. She may not be anybody's dog by the time we get her to town. Now, I don't want him to go along. I got my reasons. Please! Come on, Joe. Please, please! It's all my fault! Let me go! <laughs> she wouldn't even look at me. She knows I did it. Did what? I saw something moving in the grass. I thought it was a fox. I didn't even know the gun would go off. <laughs> Mom, it was me. I shot my own lassie. Jeff. I think I'm to blame for this as much as you are. Maybe more. I'm supposed to teach you things. Not just tell you what to do. But I... I shut my eyes to this. I ran away. Because I didn't want you ever to learn about guns. I was wrong. You can't just run away from unpleasant things and... and you can't shut your eyes to what the world is really like. Any more than... You could stop accidents by pretending that you'll never do anything dangerous. Or by hiding all the guns in the world. You've got to learn to live with these things. I realize that now. Goodness. Lassie's all right. Are you sure? Doc says she likely got her foot caught in one of my fox traps. Wait a minute. You you do you tell him. He's right here. Hello, Mr. King. Is she all right? Well, like I told you more, she got her foot caught in one of my fox traps. She wasn't shot? Of course not. Are you sure? Are you sure she wasn't? Here, hold on a minute. She's right here handy. Go on, talk. <laughs> Thanks, Mr. King. Thanks a lot. Oh, Mom. Oh, darling. I come to the fair. What are you so happy about? Because it's a wonderful, beautiful morning, and everything's wonderful and beautiful. Goodness. <laughs> oh. What's the matter? No, Lassie. You gotta keep the bandage on. That's what the doctor said. Steady. How can you forget so soon? It just happened yesterday. Well, you're just cleaning it. Yeah, just cleaning it. Looks pretty good. He's coming over. Now look, Ellen, you've got to face it. It's like falling off a horse. Got to climb right back on again. Okay with you, Gramps will teach me how to use it. 
Oh, Jeff. What are you crying for, Mom? <laughs> because I love you. 